Hey, what is up, ladies and gentlemen? It's Cody Carpenter here from the YouTube channel Cody Knows. If you are not subscribed yet, click that subscribe button below and that little notification bell to stay up to date with all my future videos. So this video is going to be very short and to the point. I'm going to show you how to add negative keywords into your Bing Ads campaign so you don't get in trouble when an offer says no brand bidding. To do this, it only takes like 30 seconds to do and it can save you from getting in trouble with your affiliate manager. Uh, so before I dive into this, I'm actually on day two of my Bing Ads direct linking case study. I haven't posted it yet, but maybe by the time you're watching it, uh, this video will be posted. My Bing Ads direct linking case study has been live for two days, so my ads have been active for two days. Um, yesterday I actually made a few sales as you can see so I'm gonna refresh my max bounty account uh, today there's no sales but well, who knows I might get a few more today but yesterday I did 160 so so it was super exciting to see that day one of my Bing as direct linking case study resulted in a few sales as you can see 160 in revenue I spent a little over a hundred dollars yesterday and made 160 um, today, I'm not sure what my numbers are at, but I'm hoping to see a few more sales. Anyways, that's just a little update on the case study, so stay tuned for that. And for this example, for adding negative keywords, so this is the example I'll use, heart attack defense supplement, um, US, Canada, AU, New Zealand, UK. So if I had a campaign on Bing ads running and the it said no brand bidding, this is what I would do right away when I set up the campaign. I would do heart attack defense I'd copy it I'd come over to Bing and I'd go to my campaign then I'd go into the keywords tab right here and then click negative keywords and then I'll paste it in between some quotations and that puts it at phrase match automatically so if someone types in heart attack defense our ads won't show and then we're compliant with the offer if someone types in heart attack defense review our ad still won't show because it's on phrase match. So even if you did it on exact match, the same thing. So I like to do phrase match. And another thing you can do is go to the offer page. And right here it says Dr. Sam Walters. Um, you can also put that in between quotations. Because that's another brand right there. And then just go through the sales page and find find out like all the brand names and then add them as negative keywords on phrase match and sometimes I'll see uh, the search restrictions no brand bidding they'll give you a list of examples like you can't bid on this this that and if that was the case we'd copy it from there and do the same thing so once you do that you can click save and then your ads won't show up for these brand related keywords so I hope you guys I hope that helps some of you guys uh, it's very important to comply with all the offers that you are running because once you get caught if you ever get caught uh, brand bidding on an offer that does not look good um, it kind of ruins the trust that you want to have established with your affiliate manager so anyways that is it very short very sweet if you are not subscribed to my channel yet click that subscribe button below and that notification bell to stay up to date with all my future videos and i will see you guys in the next one peace